and as a bonus the players are going to uh, train in Spain this weekend, uh, what would you like to get out of the experience? I think it's all the more vital now that the amount of players we've got, and I was mindful when we tried to arrange this trip, um, that we'd be bringing in lots of new players and they needed to try and spend some time together, because sometimes you've only got, they're only with each other for six hours a day, and I know that might sound a lot, but you know, I mean, really be together. When you're on a training pitch, you know, you're going to work with different units and you might work with different groups, but they're going to be together and they're going to be two or three days, and I think that's, that'll be important. They get to know each other a little better. Some of them don't know each other too well, but I think that you know the group are very welcoming, like they always are, and I think that it, it, it'll do us the world of good getting together for these two or three days. And can it sometimes be a bit of a risk adding so many new players to a team? It can, absolutely. Yeah, you know, there's no doubt about that. You, know, you don't know if they're going to gel, you don't know if the certain combinations of players are going to work. But we had to bring some in because we needed to. We needed to, so there's always a risk. Um, no, so, and we'll be bringing more in because we have to. No, no, so we, you know, not, I've stated that we need forwards and wide players, and we still need to bring forwards and wide players in, and that's what we we'll continue to do. And you mentioned uh, the next transfer targets, forward and wide players. Uh, how soon would you like to think that they could come to the club? Well, I think that you know nothing's going to happen until next, certainly next week. Um, and we've, 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 you know, we've probably had probably got six to eight targets, but it's whether we can get them or not. It's you know it's yeah, it pulls down, pulls down to finances, and you know we've we've got some uh, finances available, uh, but it's just whether or not we can afford to, 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 to get those players. And we have had a couple of forwards on play, uh, trial with quite a bit of experience, like Alan Connell and Jamie Curiton. Are they two targets that you? Well, they're coming. We're going to have a closer look at them. Uh, Connell's played at a decent level, so is well, obviously Curiton, who's a million pound player. Um, we we we, we look closely at them. No, but again, it falls down to the, the, the same thing, really. But it, you know, it, it shows that they want to be here. It shows that they're coming to to try and have a go and commit. So you know, we, we'll see over the next week or two. I mean, you know, there's no great rush as yet uh, because we've still got four weeks to go until the season starts. Would I like to have had them in and work with them? Yeah, I, I think we would, but you can't always do that. We have to really try and get value for money. We have to really try and get what's best for this club. And we can't really, uh, we have to try and get it right because if we don't get it right, it's very, very difficult to, to get other players in because of our, we've spent our budget, you know, so we have to, I'm really mindful of that.